The Notre Dame Environmental Change Initiative focuses on an umbrella that covers coupled human and natural ecosystems, but the thrust areas are really diverse and interdisciplinary. Climate change and adaptation, ecological forecasting, environmental genomics, water resources and hydrology. We have a diverse portfolio of interests that really reflects the over 50 faculty that are engaged in the initiative. They are always willing to step outside of their disciplinary box and try something new. And we've seen that, for example, in the way that they engage the community. So stakeholders, partners, reaching outside of the academy to create research that um, has outcomes that benefit policy or management. I don't think a decade ago, many faculty would be saying that's part of what I do. And now because ECI has created this opportunity, it's become the norm. And this meets a lot of what federal agencies are asking for in terms of broader impacts. I mean, who would have ever thought that um, scientists and engineers would be engaging with faculty in the College of Architecture to build out someplace like ND Leaf? That is one of those wins that I think people think is pretty unique. I think ECI has um, an innovative way that we train students and young early career researchers. We call it a vertically integrated model um, where undergraduates are working closely with graduate students who work with postdocs who work with faculty. We're creating an integrated community of collaborations that's built on trusted research relationships. For Notre Dame and for other universities looking at us, it's more about how do we do world-class research around that environmental umbrella um, while being uniquely Notre Dame. And for us, uniquely Notre Dame means meeting the mission of the university, which I think is a charge that all of our engaged faculty are, are moving forward on. We call it science serving society.